this is Michelle. Welcome to my channel, Grateful Creations. Well, anyone who happened to tune in to the live auction yesterday, it didn't happen. Um, my internet went out at the exact same time. It's like, I don't know, a cosmic joke. And electronics and technology, they just don't like me. <laughs> so I do plan on having reschedule, but I'm not exactly sure when that's gonna be given that I'm going to be doing the fluid art boutique. It's going to be kind of difficult for me to fit it all in with shipping and everything. So uh, the reason I wanted to do it yesterday and it was so important to me was yesterday was Ukraine's Independence Day. So anyhow, we will catch up and um, I might catch up before. Who knows? I don't know if I find some time, but I am going to be doing a shadow pour tonight not with color art, with TLPs. So I'm gonna be teaching this in the class. I hadn't planned on it because um, I wasn't sure if the piggies would work with this new recipe. And I will divulge that recipe after the food art boutique, just to give people who are attending first crack at it. So. I have Amsterdam. These are my two paints, and they are separate from these. These are these are all mixed just with the recipe. So this is um, do to do to do Naples Yellow Red Light, Liquitex Iridescent Graphite, and Liquitex Light Portrait Pink. These are all opaques. Now, when you mix up pigments, they're usually transparent but we are going to make these guys um, react a little bit differently so let me take these out of the way I've already pinned my canvas I sprayed the back I have taped it I have put my tacky paint on as you can see and I am going to do something a little bit different with this now these are the uh, pigments. This is Hustle. Oh, I love this one. Now these three I'm showing, no, these three I'm showing you. This is Caramel Drizzle, mixed with a special ingredient. And oh man, I don't have enough of this. This is, it's one of my favorite colors. You'd think I'd know it by now. It's Afterglow, whoops. Afterglow, I didn't even have to look at it. So I've mixed these up to make them paint and I've mixed them up so that they are um, of a thin consistency. So as, oh, and I also have, um, this is TLP and King of Pains. And this is TLP in Brulee. Okay, we also have TLP in Harvest Gold. And that's it. That's it, that's all. Well, we're not gonna say that yet. So what I'm gonna do, I wanna create something kind of different. So I am going to spread these out to make like an ombre on this side. I'm going to use them in the pour as well. So I'm going to take my lovely spatula. I've been doing some cleaning. I'm going to bring it down like this. Just like we've done in previous pours. But I just want this corner to be the ombre. Ombre! Sounds very cowboyish. So I'm very, I'm looking very, very much forward to the Fluid Art Boutique. We've got some amazing artists. Mina Villegas, Sarah Mack, Kathleen Osmore, Erica Hughes, um, who else? Karen Durishan, and we also have Molly of Molly's Artistry, and yours truly. I'm so excited. I can't believe it. All right, 
So now we're gonna take our cloud mix to pour it on. And then we're going to tilt it off. Okay. This is a 16 by 20 inch gallery wrap level two canvas. I like these because they are thinner and they work really well with the uh, pearl recipe. Oops. And here we go. Off to the races. Using some of the uh, like the groovy and hustle and any of the opaque ones, it takes a little bit longer to stir them all up. All right, where's my? There it is. All right. <clears throat> now, what kind of composition am I going to create here? All right, I'm going to start with the Amsterdam. Uh, Naples yellow red light. Okay. Then I'm going to go in the Bouvet. But I don't want to use all of it because I want to use it for some accents later too. Then... one that's going to react. And then I'm going to put the Harvest Gold down. And then this is the Soft Pink. This is also reactive. A lot of paint, Michelle. In your paint. And last but not least, iridescent graphite. It's always too much paint. You know, I'm tempted to put them in squirt bottles because it's just, it's out of control, you know? <laughs> I'm out of control. We're gonna have a blast at the uh, food art boutique. We got some events planned. Well, we, I should say, the Fab Four. And Erica Hughes is coming all the way from England which I kind of consider her royalty because she's coming from England. So I'm hoping 
If I didn't, if one of my classes doesn't fill up, I'm gonna take one of her classes. She's amazing. I actually started watching her when I first started pouring. She is, she gave me so many tips and tricks. I was just uh, astounded. Especially with the color combinations and composition. Ooh. I don't know what that corner is going to do. I kind of covered it up anyways, right? And I don't know what happened here, but I'm not going to fret over that. It's really curling up nice. Oh, jeez Louise. I've got a rag right here. So, I might blow this. Um, we'll see. I'm going to give it another torch. Oh, it dripped there. Oh, there's a lot of paint over there. I like pinks and grays together. So I am going to put you on time lapse. Are you straight? There we are. And I'm going to play. And uh, yeah, this technique I will be teaching at the Fluid Art Boutique. Where's my? There it is. <laughs> Gorgeous pearls. Look at that. And we'll see what happens here. All right, put me on time.
is almost dry. That's that Harvest Gold. <clears throat> yeah, I am pretty darn happy with this. There's the Burleigh coming through here. Yeah, it's a little bit wet. It's got about another, I don't know, 10 hours, maybe less. They dry pretty quick. Yeah, I'm liking this a lot. And see how, um, so there were three of the paints that had the secret ingredient in them. And one was the, good God. Oh, one was Hustle, one was uh, Caramel Drizzle, and the other one was, um, I'm in awe right now, I'm sorry. See, look at, see right there. It's got like, it's, that's why I call it a shadow pour. Because it's got this like shadow to show up. Very cool. Oh, not to mention my own shadow. <laughs> now over here, it did um, come through a bit, but not as much as the color art. So we have options, ladies and gentlemen. We have options. Glow. That's what I was meaning to say. Sorry about the glare from the. This is a daytime shoot. Oh, I might clean that up a bit. I'm not sure. It kind of looks out of place. But um, yeah, please be safe and create. Please like, share, and subscribe. And ciao for now. See you at the Fluid Art Boutique. Bye now.